Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from 1001 Sandwiches of 1936, we're going to be making the ham, cheese, pineapple sandwich. That's right. Ham dash cheese dash pineapple. Naturally enough, we start off with chopped up ham. We had uh, grated American cheese, pineapple, and this is where it starts to veer off the road a little bit. Green bell pepper, nutmeg, and cinnamon. Get that all mixed together. Oddly enough, there's no binder in this uh, recipe. I don't know why. And we uh, put that onto buttered white bread. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's give this binderless ham, cheese, pineapple sandwich a go. So the cinnamon and the nutmeg are kind of making the ham taste like it's a glazed ham. Not entirely, but just a little bit. And it's working with the cheese. And the thing that I did not think would work at all, the green bell pepper, is actually kind of a nice flavor in here. I do want to plus it up though. I'm giving it the grilled cheese treatment. Okay, let's give this ham, cheese, pineapple sandwich plus up with the grilled cheese treatment a go. That is pretty good. Now the cheese is getting melty and the seasoning is going throughout the sandwich. A little bit of sweetness from the pineapple, but it's not overpowering. So, okay, so the original ham, cheese, pineapple sandwich, I do wish there was some sort of binder in it for the version that wasn't grilled. Um, I'm gonna give that a six. It was interesting. It was actually pretty tasty. And then it plussed up with the grilled cheese treatment. I think that's a seven. It's much more interesting uh, when it's heated up like this. You get the outside, get a little texture. Uh, all the flavors are melding together. I think it's actually quite tasty like this. I'm definitely gonna finish that and I would make the plussed up version again. Yeah, it's tasty, go figure. <laughs> all right, see you tomorrow. See, I told you I was going to finish it.